Neurofibromatosis type 1 or NF1 is a condition that has autosomal dominant inheritance. A much less common type of neurofibromatosis is neurofibromatosis type 2 or NF2. This is associated with acoustic neuromas. For this video we will concentrate on neurofibromatosis type 1. An older term for neurofibromatosis type 1 is von Recklinghausen or von Recklinghausen's disease. And the neurofibromatosis type 1 or NF1 gene is found on chromosome 17. Having said that, some patients with neurofibromatosis type 1 have new mutations. And neurofibromatosis type 1 is quite a common condition affecting one in three to four thousand people. There are a number of signs associated with neurofibromatosis type 1. These include multiple neurofibromas. These are benign peripheral nerve sheath tumours. Caffeo lace spots and these are birthmarks that may occur anywhere and they are light brown skin macules and found in 90% of patients with neurofibromatosis type 1. And six or more greater than 1.5 centimetres across in an adult is indicative of neurofibromatosis type 1. Another feature seen in the skin with patients with neurofibromatosis type 1 are freckles in the armpits and groin areas. And the other feature of neurofibromatosis type 1 is the presence of Lish nodules and these are pigmented hamartomas of the iris and these occur in 94% of patients with NF1 over the age of 6. These are cafe au lait spots. This is the cut surface of a neurofibroma this neurofibroma arose in the costal cartilage. And here are some examples of Lish nodules. And these are the pigmented hamartomas that arise in the iris. Neurofibromatosis type 1 is not only associated with cafe au lait spots, Lish nodules and neurofibromas. There are numerous other conditions that are associated with NF1 and these include bone malformations such as short stature, scoliosis and kyphosis, macrocephaly, that's a large head, ADHD, that's attention deficit disorder, gliomas and meningiomas, aneurysms and coarctation of the aorta, renal artery stenosis and numerous tumours including Wilms tumour, that's nephroblastoma, a malignant kidney tumour of childhood, pheochromocytoma, that's a tumour arising in the adrenal glands, rhabdomyosarcoma, a malignant tumour of striated muscle and epithelioid sarcoma. But there are many other types of tumour that are more common in patients with NF1 and these include many types of sarcoma, not just epithelioid sarcoma and rhabdomyosarcoma, breast cancer, melanoma, acute lymphoblastic leukemia, ovarian cancer and prostate cancer. Finally here are a couple of pictures of tumours that may be associated with neurofibromatosis type 1. This is a nephroblastoma or Wilms tumour. And this is a meningioma that we are zooming into. And that is the well circumscribed pale nodule arising near the brain stem.